Platypuses might as well be alien life forms on Earth. They lay eggs. They sweat milk. They have glowing biofluorescent fur, venomous spikes on the backs of their legs, and 10 sex chromosomes, when mammals are supposed to have only two. They are one of only five extant species of monotremes, creatures that came into being millions of years before modern mammals ever appeared on the scene. Now, what is arguably the world's most bizarre mammal has had its complete genome mapped by scientists. Exposing its genes has finally explained how and why it evolved some of its more extreme features. Ever since Europeans discovered the platypus in the late 1700s, the bizarre duck-billed semi-aquatic creature has perplexed researchers. Modern-day researchers are still trying to understand how the platypus, largely considered to be the world's oldest mammal, came to be. For the first time, researchers at the University of Copenhagen have mapped a complete platypus genome, providing answers to how some of the platypus' bizarre features emerged. The platypus belongs to an ancient group of mammals, monotremes, which existed millions of years prior to the emergence of any modern-day mammal. By comparing the platypus genome with that of one of the only other living monotreme species, the short-beaked Echidna, researchers can build a better understanding of the genes that led to the creature's distinctive traits. Indeed, the platypus belongs to the mammalia class, but genetically it's a mixture of mammals, birds, and reptiles. It has preserved many of its ancestors' original features, which probably contribute to its success in adapting to the environment they live in, said Professor Guoji Zhang from the University of Copenhagen. Monotremes are best known for their unique ability to both lay eggs and nurse their young once they have hatched. Researchers note that one of the platypus' most unusual characteristics is its ability to feed its hatched young by excreting milk through its sweat. According to the research published in the journal Nature during our own evolution, humans lost their vitelogenin genes, which are important for the production of egg yolks. Chickens, for example, have all three of these genes. Instead, we developed casein genes, which are responsible for our ability to produce casein protein, a major component in mammalian milk. Platypuses still carry one vitelogenin gene, despite having lost the other two roughly 130 million years ago, which allows them to lay eggs. But they also carry the casein genes, allowing the creatures to develop milk that is very similar to cow's milk. It informs us that milk production in all extant mammal species has been developed through the same set of genes, derived from a common ancestor which lived more than 170 million years ago, alongside the early dinosaurs in the Jurassic period. Every other mammal on Earth, including humans, have two sex chromosomes, but the platypus has ten, including five Y and five X chromosomes. Researchers now believe the chromosomes were organized in a ring form, which was later broken away into many small pieces of X and Y chromosomes in ancient monotreme ancestors. At the same time, the genome mapping reveals that the monotreme sex chromosomes have more in common with chickens than with humans, suggesting an evolutionary link between mammals and birds.